and through the night this cluster of moisture heads in our direction. So later in the night, rain chances do come up a bit. We're looking at this more so before sunrise, and then as we go into the uh, mid morning hours, getting past sunrise, well that cluster of storms starts to exit. But I wouldn't be surprised for the start of your day that morning commute you encounter some downpours or perhaps wake up to a few rumbles of thunder. Now going into late morning, the clouds associated with that break up and then our temperatures, they're going to heat up again. Highs tomorrow back toward the upper 80s. Now you could see a couple of those isolated downpours and storms trying to pop up again. It is not out of the question for Friday afternoon that you encounter a brief shower or a quick downpour. They will be very isolated, so it is not going to be a washout, but I can't rule that out during at least the early afternoon. Toward Friday evening, we're looking at any clouds out there clearing out, and Friday evening does look pretty nice. Temperatures becoming comfortable through the evening, dropping back into the 60s overnight into Saturday. Now for Saturday, we're going to see a mix of sun and scattered clouds through the day. One thing I'll be watching is a cluster of storms passing by into western Ohio. I do expect that to send some clouds to the valley. Temperatures will jump to around 90, and we are going to have to watch again during the afternoon for some spotty hit or miss downpours and storms. This may be a little overdone, but the timing is does line up when I'm looking for some of those spotty showers or storms possible. And then into Saturday evening, that activity also starts to wane. Now for Sunday, a cold front approaches the area. And as we go, especially into the latter part of the day, we'll be watching for this to touch off some thunderstorms into Sunday evening. Especially I do expect another round of a bit more widespread rain and storms possible that carries over into Monday morning, starts to push off to our south into Monday evening. So 65 tonight, a passing shower or an isolated storm as we come up on daybreak tomorrow. That's something we'll watch for the morning commute. Don't be surprised if you encounter some downpours or wake up to rumbles of thunder. The afternoon, very hit or miss variety showers or storms possible. Not a washout. Watching Saturday for a few raindrops around. Sunday, best chance for rain and storms will be later in the day, especially Sunday night. Some wet weather working through the area, carrying over into your Monday. This weekend is is looking hot around 90 both days and then that cold front on Sunday it does drop our temps a little bit but by dropping temps we're talking highs falling to the mid 80s for the early part of next week.